now i'll be doing one method one method is called as traversing after traversing i'll end the class yeah traverse means to read the data all the data whichever you have read it to read the data same thing traversing okay i have i have written a generalized printf right this printf i have read it right so this printf will give me what 40 this printf will give me what 40 so i'll be writing my own traverse method how do i write the own traverse method so i'll tell it has uh, okay i'll write a method called as oh, i will create a block i'll create a block for this block i will give a beautiful name what is a beautiful name i'll give it i'll tell it as traversing right so i'll tell us since it's a block i'll let us traverse i'll let us traverse okay since it is a method i'll be having i might be having the argument so i'll give the parameters for this okay done okay now tell me now tell me okay whenever you think it guys you need to think in the false side also you need to think in the right true side also you need to think in the both the side okay what what if it is no nodes at all okay what if it is no nodes at all at the time what you will do it okay what if it is their node okay if you have node what you will do it if you don't have a notes what you will do it okay if you don't have a notes travel karke fayda nahi hai right so when you will get to know there is no node just think it when you will get to know there is no node right if the root is equal equal to not first thing i'll come here i'll tell it has if if i'll tell it has root equal equal to null i will tell it right if it has root equal equal to null i'll tell one printf statement i'll just tell one printf statement i'll tell it as no notes i'll tell it no notes right no notes i'll tell it so if you want to get a demo i can get it get you okay what i want to return it what i want to return it i'll return it i'll return nothing are it you are written nothing okay just to end the my statement and just to end my block i'll tell it like this but what i'm returning it i'm returning nothing so what is this written type is void if i write it before inserting if i write it here okay if i call this method call what what is the method i want to call it traverse right i want to call the traverse method so i'll call this traverse method so what i'll get it no nodes right no nodes so if i if i want to write it here i will declare this methods i'll declare this method i'll write as void i'll write it as traverse right i'll tell us traverse there is no parameters also for this right t v e r s e okay so i'll go for here i'll tell it has compile this i'll dot slash e dot all right so what is this now it is nothing but first one first line right when you don't have a node so it will create it new nodes after that it will give you okay that after that it is inserted right after that it is inserted so now i'll come here i'll come here i will i will i will i will i will write the other logic okay other logic is very simple you have already done it you have already done it okay so if there is a node what i need to do it okay if there is no node okay you are telling that okay done this is the condition if there is no node this is the condition fine it is working fine no problem with that if there is a node if there is a node what i need to do it if there is a node i just want to traverse this i just want to traverse this, this line you know it right? jumping thing jumping thing same line i'll be writing it now same thing i'll be writing it okay so i'll check it out i'll check it out for traversing okay i'll check it out for traversing i'll i'll just check it out i'll copy this for the first time okay I, the initial address is inside the root i cannot change the root value so that what i'll do it i'll copy to one temporary variable i'll let us one temporary variable okay i want to declare this temporary variable as a local variable so i'll write as temporary variable i'll declare this as a local variable i'll let us start and this is nothing but node type and node is nothing but what struct type right i'll declare this variable now inside the temporary variable you have the initial address right in the inside the temporary variable you have the initial address now oh look here when root was null when root is null then it will print it no nodes okay if root is not equal to null at least to one okay at least to one uh one 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 it will be there guys at least one it will be there that means temp is not equal to null right so i'll just tell it i'll just tell it while temp i'll tell it instead of comparing it i'll just tell it while temp okay i'll just tell while temp okay while temp i'll tell it okay while while temp i will tell it okay i'll tell you why it is okay while temp okay that means thousand if there is a thousand yes it is a true it is true right so what i need to Print it while thousand. What I need to print it? I want to print the data. So I'll come here. I'll just print the data. I'll let us print a percentage D. I'll tell it, or else I can tell it like this. I can print address also. 
right so address i'll tell us percentage p i'll let us percentage d now right i'll let us slash in and i'll tell it has and i'll tell it has what is this for address how do we tell it i'll let us temp of address address i'll tell it for data i'll tell it as temp of data i'll tell it right i'll let us temp of data same thing array formation remember i'll let us data so i'll let us done temp of data so i'll tell it as here instead of telling the space instead of telling the space i'll i'll tell it as i'll tell it as slash t slash t since address will be in the very longer format i'll give a format for this one i'll give a design for this okay how do i give the design for this print f i'll tell it has address i'll tell it slash t slash t i'll tell it here i'll give a single slash t guys okay slash t slash t i'll tell it and i'll tell it as data i'll tell it right i'll let us slash in to make a differentiation i'll tell it has what print f it's just my traversing program i'm writing it guys so you can even write it by your own way right slash in i'll write it like this all right this is not actually needed right? it's just my interest that's it got it so this is very important i have traversed it right so first node i'm printed it okay now what i need to do it i want to jump it guys what is the jumping line what is the jumping line i'll be writing it jumping line jumping line tell me the jumping line is jumping line where is jumping line this is called as jumping line right this is called as jumping line right i call it as jumping line what i need to do it i want to copy the address of this one to here right for example for example this is a single node guys okay that means this is a null right this will be null right that means you don't have next node you don't have what next node okay if it is not equal to null then means i have a next node also i want to copy this address to a temporary variable how do i copy it by a jumping statement this is called a jumping statement right so now what i'll do it i'll i'll tell it as in interview don't tell it it is jumping statement that name i have given it okay so i i tell it as has a jumping statement to remember it okay so how to write a jumping statement whatever you have it in temp of address you copy to whom you copy to temp you copy to temporary variable equal to temp done that's it done after this you will come here and you will print it something like this print f print f you will tell it has i'll tell it as star star star, star i'll tell it as the end i'll tell it okay the end i'll tell it this one i'll put it in the this while statement i'll put it in the okay this like this and this is now neat now right so after this Travis. at the last also i will call it travis at last also i'll call it travis travis right i'll call it travis then i'll call it this has travis so if i run this if i run this program it didn't print i want to put this in a block all right i forgot to put this in a block I'm very much sorry i i forgot to put put this inside the block so i'll come here i'll put this in the block why because this is ye apna lega apna line ye nahi apna lega right it will treat it as a third line next line right so this if is hugging this only this line if you are not putting a block right if you put a block this if will hug all all the lines which is inside the block right so i will run this program right i'll enter this all right so what do you have it look onto this Look on the first address is nothing but what this one. This will be your root address itself, right? Zero three zero, and you have data called as ten. And the last one, you can see this. Okay, this one and this one. Your last thing has a null. This is a hexadecimal null. Okay, this is a hexadecimal null, and data will be what forty. Got it? Data will be what forty. Then for this, you need to do some presentation skills, presentation thing. So that will be even this one will be okay for you. Got it, guys? And you have at the end and done, done with this. Okay, this is the traversal for you. This is the traversal for you. Okay, actually, for to be honest, you don't want to decoration thing. So I'll just comment it. If if you if you're not writing this, things decoration if you wanted it. Comment it, comment it. If you don't want it, this, I'll comment this. All right, data such as right, some standards we need to maintain it. Right, so if I run this program again, I'll tell it like this compile it, I'll let us dot slash dot out. So I have everything which is nothing but like this. Right? This is the data now. This is the data. Done. Okay, take down this, take down the Travis function. What is the main part of Travis function? Only so much. This is your logic for Travis. That's it. First, you need to check it whether there is a data, if there is no data no notes if there is a data what do you need to do it you need to print it 
so you will be printing it and you will be traversing it that's done okay any queries guys any queries any queries i'm sorry and uh, tell them i will be sending the recorded video for them okay i have logged it okay i have logged the class okay so session is open for the queries guys you can ask the queries and you can go for it okay those who understood this they even can try for uh, what tomorrow what i'll what i'll teach it delete right a method called as delete so if you have you can do it by yourself and you can comment how to delete a node right uh, there will be two possibilities how to delete a node if it is a first node if it is a last node if it is in between the node there are three things which you need to understand it okay what if it is a first node what do you how do you delete it what if it is a last node how do you delete it how if it is an in between node how do you delete it right so those are all the things you need to know about it okay now can i call multiple times yes uh, for the same program can i call multiple times uh, for example in the for loop in the in this one okay in this one how do i call this look under this uh i will call it something like this guys okay i will erase this everything i will write it only i okay for this i i will tell it i plus i will tell it to pass the data okay so here what i will do it i will tell it has uh i will tell it has i will tell it has for for int i is equal to zero i less than i can call it whatever the data is like if you want to 100 100 i can tell it 20 20 data i can tell it i plus plus i will tell it right this insert method is calling how many times 20 times right this insert method is calling how many times 20 times and this is printing me the fourth fourth data okay and this one i don't want it right now this one i don't want it right now so i'll remove this so i want i will remove this right so after this before that i i call it traverse and after that i am calling 20 times insert of that i am calling traverse right so what i'll do it now i'll run this program uh if you look on to this i'll tell it as dot slash e dot out you have data is creating it 20 data are creating it and all the data are printed okay from 10 11 uh, the first time you are calling Travis, there is no data. So later on, you are calling all the data like this. And these are all the values for this. These are all the values for this. Right? Here you can pass it whatever the values you wanted it, right? So you can tell it has i plus or i into, so that it will be like different, right? So I'll let us i into i whatever the values right plus i you can tell it so you, if you tell it like this some equation i'm passing it dot slash a dot o u t out so i'll tell it as like this right so this is all the values i'm passing it so, so how many blocks i have created i have created around 20 blocks i have created it so last will be what null right so this is how it is linked this is how it is linked done okay if you want to know correct structure of this guys if you want to know correct structure of this i can tell it has something like this guys okay so this is the address data in the travis program in the travis program itself this is the address data right i can give the content data also okay how do i get the content data i'll write it as percentage p again okay i'll write it as percentage uh, p again you will get the correct exact link list how it is working so in place of your first one, you will tell it as temporary variable data. Okay, inside this temporary variable, what's going on, right? So what I can tell it now, temporary is a blocks address, and this one is the content address, right? Look onto this. And so I'll compile this dot slash a dot o u t out, right? So look onto this. This is linked now. This this address you can see it. Look here. This is my first node. Okay, this is my first node. Okay, this is my first node. The first node's address is stored in root. If I print it here root, I'll get the same data. Okay, and inside this address and data, you have it, right? Data is nothing but zero. This one is nothing but address, right? So this one's address is stored. The second block's address is stored inside the first block address. So you can see this links here. Okay, you can see the links here, how I'm making the links. 
look at this this is nothing but here it is linked here right here sorry here it is linked here this block is linked to this one so on it is linked going on right so on it is linked to this one okay for example if i want to print if i want to print the day root if i print the root here okay so let's let's say like this uh, let's say like instead of uh, printing travis here instead of printing travis here so what i'll do it i'll print it root here right before before telling the travis before traveling travis i'll just print it here print f i'll tell it as percentage d i'll let us slash in i'll let it as root right i'll let us root now so here i'll let us root root equals right so i'll tell it as like this and I'll compile it. Okay, that's fine. No problem. It oh so 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 sorry 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 sorry. It should be in the hexadecimal. Root is in the address, right? So I'll let us percentage p here. So I'll write this and I'll let a dot slash a dot o it here. Okay, go for this. One. That's it. Done. Okay, so your root address is this one. The root is this one, and uh, root is this one, and you have it here. Okay, that's it. That. If you have any queries, let me know, guys. And the placement hoga reba. Placements are coming. To your college okay placements are coming to your college uh, get ready in the programming thing you will be placed jab aayega na tab aapko knowledge bhi nahi hoga right look here today also there was one drive people went at uh i have sent you one uh, number right you can contact to them they will help you out Thank you.